Another significant factor in weight loss or a root cause of weight gain is your hormones. And no, I'm not talking about estrogen or uh, progesterone or testosterone, although they do have a role in weight gain or, or weight loss. I'm referring to the metabolic hormones, uh, insulin and cortisol and leptin and adiponectin and ghrelin. Uh, these are the hormones that are responsible for hunger, uh, energy and cravings and have to be managed appropriately in order to establish a, a healthy food management plan going forward. Uh, insulin is your body's natural storage hormone. Your body produces it as you, ha as you um, eat more sugar and sugar gets into the bloodstream uh, or carbohydrates and carbohydrates break down into sugar that uh, enter the bloodstream. Um, insulin is responsible for taking that sugar and storing it and it gets stored as fat. Uh, the, more, the, the more sugar and the more carbohydrates that you, that you consume. And over years of doing this, your body becomes resistant to the insulin, which results in, in more and more uh, 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 fat storage. So, uh, so that's, that's one of the reasons why we want to manage uh, insulin specifically. But then we, we've got cortisol. And cortisol, as everybody knows, that uh, our modern uh, lifestyle is unnaturally stressful. And so we are unnaturally producing more cortisol. Uh, this causes uh, slowing of our metabolisms. This causes you to store fat around the midsection. This causes you to crave sugar uh, and could even lead to de depression with uh, high levels of chronic cortisol. Um, but then we've got uh, the other three, which uh, ghrelin is like the uh, the gremlin hormone. I like to refer to it. It is it's it's your hunger hormone. It's what it's uh, it's it's what tells your brain that you're hungry. Um, and then there's leptin, uh, which uh, leptin is uh, what what tells us that we're full. It's the opposite of ghrelin, and it also tells us to uh, to burn more to burn uh, to burn more calories. And so we want leptin, and we, but the, the problem is, is the more fat that we have, uh, leptin is released from fat cells. And so the more fat we have, the more leptin that we have being released, uh, we can eventually become leptin resistant as well, which then causes our body to hunger more and want more food and, and never get full. So uh, you can see where this can be a problem. And then there's adiponectin, which is the coolest of all of them. The more adiponectin we have in our bloodstream, the more fat we burn so we want more of that um, we use a, uh, a formula in our a metabolic formula in our office to help uh, manage and support these three hormones specifically adiponectin leptin and ghrelin so that we can control uh, appetite and satiety and fat uh, uh, fat metabolism and this helps us to, to, to manage the weight loss and and help to keep it off and get get the get the metabolic hormones balanced so uh, so we have future uh, uh, success when it comes to uh, to weight loss and, and, and overall just uh, overall health so if you've gained benefit from this or uh, if you feel like somebody else would please just share this uh, also um, if you'd like more information on these hormones these these metabolic hormones and how we address those in the office uh, just reach out to us we can get you into to one of our our workshops uh, to give you more information on that and see if you potentially would be a candidate for, for uh, uh, addressing these issues in our office.